Hi everyone and welcome to another video on I Do Care. Today I am bringing you a very, very happy video because in which I am going to show you some of our most recent adoptions because due to lack of time, I had not been able to show you yet. We have been accumulating and there are already enough doggies that we have been delivering to their adoptive families in recent weeks. We will start with Ron, this nice little puppy who came home with all his brothers a couple of months ago. After a few days with us, someone came for him and two of his brothers to take them to a shelter where they will stay until they find adoptive families. As you knew, Manchas and Pekas, after a quiet while at home recovering with us, they got two good adoptive families with whom today they are very happy. But in no way were we going to forget the rest of the pack. So we spent hours and hours searching on Facebook adoption groups for the perfect candidates and after much deliberation, the first lucky one who got his definitive family was little Ron. We went for him far, far away where we have already told you about on previous videos and we brought this sweetie home where we couldn't resist dying of love with him. But not only us. Well, in those days we had Bali with us at home and she was also delighted with little Ron. Not like Buster who, as you know, is a bit more cringe and well, he just ignored him. We didn't have Ron at home for even 24 hours and we already wanted to keep him. And you know, so many doggies and especially puppies come through the house it's hard and especially in our situation in which we had recently lost Baloo and I thought we couldn't find the moment to adopt another baby, each one who passed by the house, we felt in love with it and it became a difficult situation. But in the end, it is what we have to do. So after enjoying this little guy as much as we could, the time has come to take him to his new family. A mother and her son were the ones who would enjoy little Ron for the rest of his life. And this baby is not going to lack for anything. Just keep in mind that he already has his own Ferrari. That's more than clear the good life he is having. In the following days, we did our best to get the two little brothers that remained from that litter because we did not want them to grow up in the shelter and lose their opportunity to go out for adoption when they are puppies. That it is when they find a family is easier. So after spending several days totally immersed in all the Facebook adoption groups, we finally found adopters for Togo and back the two remaining puppies. But to our surprise, we also found an adopter for Bobby, a dog that we talked about very briefly a few videos ago, already an adult, which is always more complicated, but even so, we talked to a girl who gave us very good feelings. So we took advantage of the trip to far, far away to bring us the three doggies at once and take them with their definitive families. Let me show you quickly. Oh yeah. Hola, muñeca. 
Picking up the three lucky ones of the day, we traced the route map and headed to our first destination, which would be Bobby's new home. When we get a home for adult dogs and large breeds, it is very rewarding. Not just anyone gives a second chance to a dog with these characteristics, and we really couldn't be more grateful to Jennifer, who is the name of Bobby's new mother, for opening the doors of her house and her heart to this so special dog that suffered so much and spent all his entire life living in a shelter. Here I'll leave you a couple of videos that she sent us the days after the adoption. And our next stop was Togo's new home, the black of the pack. <laughs> Normally, black puppies are the most difficult to find a family. In fact, we have to mention that finding a family for Togo was almost as difficult as finding one to Babi. But in the end, we found a super nice family with a huge heart would decide to give this little guy the opportunity of his life. Hola. Mira lo que traigo. Okay, bebé. Chao, chao. And to finish, our last baby to be delivered, back. The truth is that we made the delivery in a somewhat peculiar place, and it was because his adopters were doing some shopping in a mall that was super good for us in order about where we were. So we agreed to meet here to deliver this precious little puppy. <laughs> Super good family too. They sent us some pictures and videos later, already running with their little human brother. So, so happy. shopping center where we met with Bax adopters is famous in Costa Rica for being super pet friendly, the most pet friendly there is in Costa Rica. It has several areas and parks for dogs and obviously you can walk freely through all the facilities with your dogs. In short, it is a very cool place and one of the things that I want to do, hopefully very soon, is to organize an adoption event in this mall. I tell you, family, I have many ideas and things I want to do with this beautiful project, but we have a lot to do. But well, step by step, here we go, little by little, doing the best we can. Thank you very much for your support and patience. We really appreciate your being here. And I take this opportunity to mention that if you like what we do, your help is crucial to keep doing it. So you can support us through Patreon or PayPal. I leave you the links down below in the description of the video. With a small monthly collaboration, you will be helping us a lot to continue helping these poor little animals who need us so much. Since we started with this, which was a few months ago, as you well know, we already had 21 animals put up for adoption, 20 doggies and a kitten. I know that many of you have asked us to help more kittens and it is something that is going to happen right away because the person who is taking care of Captain now has many kittens in her care and we have promised her that we are going to help find adoptive families both for the doggies and as well for the kittens that she has there. So stay tuned because many beautiful things are coming. I hope you liked the video. Please leave your comments. It's always a pleasure to read you. 
hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you like what we do. And if so, I leave you here a couple of videos that you will like them too. I send you a huge hug and see you very soon. Thank you.